keeps burning, my click stay winning, the world keeps turning, my eyesight blurry, my inner vision clear though, feeling like a hero, but the villain's not a clear foe, maybe it was me who needs to change some things, money and the glory and the power that the paper brings, maybe there was more to being king than just creative schemes, music, money, meditation, these are just my favorite things. I'm watching a friend, a co-worker, someone else succeed a lot more than you at that current time, it can be tough. It can be hard to take the situation and say, oh, well, that will be me one day. I will get to that point one day. But the thing we have to remember is that every single day is a new opportunity. And although there was an opportunity for that person that day, there will be an opportunity for you on some day. And you have to keep on working like that. You have to keep that mentality strong and clear, knowing that one day you will have the opportunity and you will take advantage of it. And then, of course, you will succeed. Sometimes when you're all alone, you feel you're away from the group. You feel out of the loop. You feel like you're not getting things done. Rather than thinking it from that perspective, I want you to take it a little bit differently. If you're alone, think about it as you're working on your craft. You're concentrating on you, and that's what it's all about, igniting the passion from within. And if you can do that every single time you are alone, you will be way far ahead of everyone else in front of you. Don't worry, don't fret. The time is yours, and the more time you have, is the more valuable you will become. Keep on working, keep on concentrating, and keep on focusing on you. Good morning everybody. Hopefully you're having a great day and you started off this day just like I did with a big old smile and a bunch of positivity. Today has been an early rise right when I woke up, went to the beach, started filming. Now I'm on my way to a coffee shop. Gonna surprise Lexi with some coffee. So let's get this day started. All right, maybe not. The line is super long. Let's just be honest, I used to be nothing But now I'm so up in a way that I'm buzzing Tonight we together, you know that's a blessing Just remembered, we're going to breakfast in about an hour So me getting her coffee, she probably is already drinking coffee right now Because I'm late coming back home And she's probably going to get coffee when we go to breakfast So I probably shouldn't get her another coffee That's three coffees She's already hyper enough <laughs> Let me ask you something. What? Did you drink any coffee? No, why? Oh! Give me about 20 minutes. I'm gonna go drop this off at the post office and then I wanna build some bikes. A few moments later. So, as you guys know, this bike, the chain broke. It's just a busted old bike. These two bikes are from Volano. So, I decided to team up with Volano, take their bikes, build them, and start riding them everywhere because Lexi and I, well, we need bikes. And if we don't have bikes, then we have to use our feet. And you know what I say about my feet? I don't like to walk around the city on my feet. I like to ride on something and use transportation. But this is forever, that's never a question. Yeah, stepping up, learning my way through the journey. This one is for me. Vibing so high, you not bringing me down. Let's find the fuck out what you think of me now. That's it? This is all the but that's so cool. Yeah. Oh good lord. So this is actually pretty cool. It comes pretty much assembled. All you have to do is attach the other wheel, the handlebars, and then you're good to go. Got pedals. I don't know what this is, but it looks cool. That's it. I will give them this. They're very good at protecting this bike. Step two, pedals complete. Handlebars, check. Whew. Last step complete. This actually might be yours, Lexi. That is a wrap. Completed this bike, baby. Uh, 20 minutes it took me, a little bit more than that. I have to go to breakfast, but if you guys do want to pick up one of these bikes, they're super lightweight. Check this out. 
super lightweight, very mobile. Obviously, it's like quick to get around with. So go to the link in the description, right there, Volano. Again, link in the description if you guys want to pick one up. Leaving all of this. This will be cleaned up later. Oh, you know? <laughs> get up. Yeah. Right. You just opened the door. I know. <laughs> Like the most difficult one. You ready for this? Ready for food. Let's go. Oh, Sorry. Okay. Let's go, guys. Sorry. We in it together, you know we all equal. Her love is a drug and my shit is so dope. She falling for luck like a slippery slope. And I know a dime, but no, 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 she don't model Live for the day, creating tomorrow Never be lazy, wave it like Cabo Go after dreams, things will follow, babe Things will follow, babe And what's the What is up? What's up? How are you, I heard you've never been here, dude No, I've never been here Hi. This is Lexi, this is my girlfriend Nice oh, awesome. to meet you My favorite is the buckwheat pancakes Buckwheat chocolate chip pancakes? What are you talking about? Oh, uh, yeah Ooh, that's mama Oh, this is great. Can you guys say hello to the vlog? Hello. What's going this on, guys? Is I'm really Hayden. And this and is Brandon Wisnant, the husband. Brandon the husband. Hayden Wisnant. Okay. Okay. Really yeah. is that is so great. <laughs> cool. Thank you. Like to add an avocado on top? Ooh, yeah. Lexi came here to eat. <laughs> Look at this. She got open. I'm a little bowl. Look at her salad. Oh my god. <laughs> see you guys. Bye. You're going to Later, gold, man. right? You're going yes, to gold. sir. We Bye. will see you at gold. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> She's coming with us. <laughs> Come with me. See you guys. I'm running really, really close to my massage time. Points at 12. It's 11.59. No. No. Oh, it's first. Are you kidding me right now? Wow, we lost. Um, Actually, you lost. That Lexi, we you. never lose. <laughs> so this kid Tim over here watched our old video, our last video, and came in for an appointment. You watched the video? Yeah, like two and, days ago. And you came here, dude. Nice, to meet you, <laughs> nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you, man. Love your videos. Dude, that's I just so discovered awesome. you like two days ago. For real? Yeah. Dude, that's so awesome. How's your shoulder feeling? It's so good. It's like ten pounds lighter. I can move it. Like it hasn't felt this good in like months. Like, yeah. Dude, I freaking. <laughs> I love this! I love it! All because of Brendan. Oh my gosh, I know it's all because of you. <laughs> See, this is the thing. All of the all of the content within my videos, they're for you guys. It's for you to take advantage. I will never give you some BS stuff. It's all the best. And this is what I have here. She falling for luck like a slippery slope. So you guys already know why I'm here. Pro massage. I'm about to get my massage in. How's the shoulder? You ready to get this money? Let's do this. My shoulder is feeling a lot better. This is why I needed to get in before yes, you left. I'm glad. I needed to get in because my shoulder is feeling a lot better. Good. And we're about to become 100%. And you know what happens when we're 100%? We go be smoke. We ignite the fire. We let the passion blow. <laughs> Neurostimulator time. Time to get that zappy zap. Time to get that money. <laughs> you ever had a tattoo before? I haven't. But if I had this a tattoo, worse. This is worse than a tattoo. Not even kidding. Oh my god! Getting that contraction. <laughs> yeah, so this uh, Interex, the neurostimulator, what it does is it, it it's electric and it penetrates into the tissue and it helps to break up scar tissue, adhesions, nerve okay. entrapment. Dude, you. this is inc yeah. this is this is actually like the <laughs> I never had a massage like this one today. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh stop 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 oh, 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 oh. Whenever I feel pain I crack up and I laugh really really hard because I think it's so funny. I don't know why. In the sky if you feeling amazed. Tonight we together, you know that's a blessing. But this is forever, they see the progression. Oh yeah, right on the beach and we doing this major. Surfing the beat like my Mac Kelly Slade. Another pro massage down. Promassage.com. Promassagela.com. Promassagela.com. Look at that shred though. 
huh? Look at that shred though. Look at the mags. go guys i just wanted to give you a quick snippet the motivation of lexi getting her workout in again subscribe to her channel if you haven't already it's right here now on with this day oh i forgot all about this stuff before i clean it up i might as well build that other bike that one's for lexi so let's get it done Definitely great. And now I don't have to worry about my chain breaking when I'm, when I'm biking. Lexi, thank you for the camera shots. She's a bomb. She's a bomb. She's getting better every day and I love it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that workout. What's going on over here? Jeffro. What are you doing over there, Jeffro? An entire chicken. He's got what? An entire rotisserie chicken. You're eating good. Look at this. You just missed your mouth. <laughs> What would you rate my lunch right now? I would rate it a three out of ten. A three? <laughs> this is a three? Yeah, it's pretty good actually. If you guys are wondering where we have all of our meetings, tell them, Jeff. Yep, everywhere, but today it's on the beach. The beach, you want to see it? This is our view right now, just so you guys can see. So if you look very, very far over there, you have the boardwalk, and then you have the water over here, and then you have people that are playing volleyball and everything right there. Those aren't us. So, we have finally made it to the end of the vlog, and you know what that means? Jeff, what does that mean? It's talk time. It's talk time. <laughs> so, I was looking at the comment section, and I saw a comment, and you remember, the end of every episode of this Ignite series, I'm going to respond to a comment or a question, and we're just gonna to touch on it and really bring some clarity to your life and answer that question in depth. So, I saw a question asking about investment. How do you know if you're investing in yourself? What does it really mean to invest in yourself? So, I'm gonna take it away and I'm gonna start off by just saying, if you're not willing to invest in yourself, then you don't believe in yourself, and you don't believe that you can achieve Every, you like that rhyme though? You, like that <laughs> you don't believe that in the end you will accomplish that goal. And that's so important. I spoke about it yesterday. Reality versus dream. When you dream, it's kind of something that's absolutely unrealistic. But reality, it is possible. Even if someone says it's impossible, it is possible. So when we talk about investment, you have to first believe in yourself. And once you believe in yourself, then you know you should be investing in yourself. Whether it is money, time, energy, uh, using someone else's knowledge in your life, whatever it may be, you have to invest in order to get to where you need to go. So, Jeff, give them, let's talk about first, let's not talk about the money aspect of it, but let's talk about the time. How much time do you actually have to put, how much energy do you actually have to invest in yourself to accomplish things? Is it that true that you need to, or? Absolutely. I mean, every single day I invest time into working out. I invest time in educating myself on business and right. finances and marketing and uh, new things that we can use in the business. Yeah. Uh, so I'm investing time. I'm investing energy. I'm it's investing all about learning, learning, right? Yeah, all about learning. I'm You're investing. Learning. You, and, and everything that you do is to better yourself. Yep. You want a stronger you in the end. Yep. I mean, that's, that's really what it's all about because if you have a stronger you, then you can approach different situations or aspects in your life and strengthen them and then eventually you as a whole is just 
powerful and you can't be defeated. Yeah, like we're, we're the type of people who strive to improve every single day in all aspects of our life, not just fitness. I mean, fitness is a big part of our lives. Yeah, who we, we are. We want to be but, healthy. You want yeah. to be super strong and healthy. Yeah, and even though like, you know, Brendan, you hear him talking about fitness quite a bit, but uh, he invests, he reads a ton. So that's investing time and energy into himself. Into I want to learn. I want to. Yeah. I want to become a stronger individual. That's what it's all about. And then, of course, the money situation. So, I am a. You guys don't know this about me, but I'm very stingy with my money, and you know that. Like, I don't like to spend money. I do not like to spend specific money if it's not going to benefit my life or people around me. So when it comes to certain things, I'll be like, you know, I'll just complain about it. And that's something that I need to work on. But at the same time, it's something that is beneficial to me because I know that every dollar, every cent spent will be used for me and to help me and other people around me. And that's where you need to look at your investment and say, okay, is this $50 to this gym that I'm never gonna go to really worth it, you know? Or is this program for 50 bucks, 70 bucks, 150, $300, is this valuable? Is this gonna be good for me? Am I going to follow it and am I going to get something from it? And if you believe in yourself and you want to get to whatever goal you want to, then you have to take those opportunities. You have to be able to say, okay, here's a $20, $20 bill for this. Oh, here is $10 to eat this specific meal because I know the nutrients are yeah. great for my body, you know? So what, what else would you say as far as investments and money goes? Like, how do you know if an investment's right? How do you know if it's going to be beneficial for you and you can trust it? Well, the cool thing about like us working together is like you're, I don't say you're stingy. I think you're maybe frugal. It might be a better word. Yeah, it's a better word. <laughs> <laughs> Not stingy. Yeah. So, but full of uh, love. Whatever, like just for example, in the business, anytime we're maybe gonna get some new software or a new program that that helps us run the business better, I'm always triple checking it. Yeah. I'm like, no, you know, no. We always have this back and forth conversation about, okay, what's this gonna, what's it gonna do? And I'm always the one saying, okay, it'll help us do this, it'll help us do this, it'll help us right. do this, which means we'll get this type of return on it. So it's good because it it forces us to look at, okay, where is this money going, and how is it gonna return back to us? You know, in value yes, in like yeah, yeah. So you, you so you want value. Yeah. That's what it comes value. down to. And investments, actually, that's that's like the the seed. Yeah. Like the it, value is the seed of everything. Like the more value you have you have in your life the more you're able to invest. The and we're, we're then the things that we're investing in are the things that will help us reach our goals faster. You right. know, maybe some software that helps us run the business more efficiently or, uh, you know. Taking like, a trip somewhere to meet with specific people or uh, a workshop, holding yeah. a workshop or helping people and putting money in for an advertisement to reach more lives yeah. on this side of the, yeah. Well, so, even like what you just said with the food. I mean, you can invest in like a cheap meal from McDonald's that's unhealthy that gives you like zero returns on that meal or you can invest in a nice strong healthy meal that's you know whatever you protein proper protein organic, carbs everything organic. Yeah. yeah yeah that's so true so that's gonna help reach help you reach your goals a lot faster whereas the other may be cheap but you're not gonna get the returns on it exactly so to end this and hopefully you guys did enjoy this vlog I want to say this believe in yourself okay once you believe in yourself is when you should be investing in yourself. And if you don't believe in yourself, you can still invest in yourself. But trust your instincts. Trust what you wanna become, where you wanna go. If it's not gonna help your goal, don't do it. But if it is going to help your goal, if it's going to get you where you need to go, then invest. And it doesn't have to be money, it can be time. It doesn't have to be time, it could be energy. Whatever it may be, give it your all, Keep on working hard, believe in yourself, and you'll get to where you want to go. You Thanks, deserve, Jeff. You yeah. deserve it. You deserve it. Thanks for uh, stopping by and, and doing you this bet. with me. Uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed this vlog. Remember, every end of every episode of Ignite Series, we're going to be talking. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this vlog, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Stay
stay winning. The world keeps turning. My eyesight blurry. My inner vision clear though. Feeling like a hero, but the villain's not a clear foe. Maybe it was me who needs to change some things. Money and the glory and the power that the paper brings. Maybe there was more to being king than just creative schemes. Music, money, meditation. These are just my favorite things. I'm watching a friend, a coworker, someone else succeed a lot more than you at that current time. It can be tough. It can be hard to take the situation and say, oh, well, that will be me one day. I will get to that point one day. But the thing we have to remember is that every single day is a new opportunity. And although there was an opportunity for that person that day, there will be an opportunity for you on some day. And you have to keep on working like that. You have to keep that mentality strong and clear, knowing that one day you will have the opportunity and you will take advantage of it. And then, of course, you will succeed. Sometimes when you're all alone, you feel you're away from the group. You feel out of the loop. You feel like you're not getting things done. Rather than thinking it from that perspective, I want you to take it a little bit differently. If you're alone, think about it as you're working on your craft. You're concentrating on you, and that's what it's all about, igniting the passion from within. And if you can do that every single time you are alone, you will be way far ahead of everyone else in front of you. Don't worry, don't fret. The time is yours, and the more time you have, is the more valuable you will become. Keep on working, keep on concentrating, and keep on focusing on you.